this is Tracy here and welcome back to the MG Tracy Club and today we're going to be taking a look at Ocean Rescue Playset from Fine and Sam. It has so many amazing features so let's take it out of the box and have a look. Let's take a look at the features. It has a ramp that just fits on here like so. Uh, we have a Juno the jet ski and a fireman Sam. So he clips into this section here and sit him up straight and off he goes. It has a control panel, a fireman's pole, it has a, a little helipad as well, uh, there's an on-off switch on the side which gives flashing lights which is rather cool and the helipad fits on just here and can be moved in any position. There's also a lift for Fireman Sam to use. And here he comes now. And here is the alarm. The roof just slides off and in here is where you put the batteries. Just slide it back on, turn it on. Very cool. So this is an amazing toy then guys. Be sure to like this video and be sure to ask your favourite adult to subscribe to the MG Tracy Club so that you see the videos first. Also, four boxes will appear. Touch on one of those boxes to continue the toy fun. Hi there guys, this is Tracy here and welcome back to the MG Tracy Club. So today I've got a Ponty Pandy rescue set to share with you. And together we can create the world of Fireman Sam. So there are three figures in this set. We've got Station Officer Steel, Fireman Sam and Tom Thomas. There are two vehicles, there's Venus and Wallaby One. It also comes with a rotating turntable, a built-in carrying handle and also a twist to hear the alarm bell. And on the side of the box it tells us all about other vehicles and other buildings that we can collect to create the world of Fireman Sam. And also available are ocean rescue vehicles and buildings. 
and mountain rescue vehicles and a building there. So then guys, I can't wait to see what's in the box, so let's take a look, shall we? Oh, wow. Oh, this is amazing. Let's take a close look at our fire station. So it has the uh, Fireman Sam logo and badges on the front there lights on either side a window and also has the folding doors that the vehicles come in and out of the station through and it opens up inside there's a little clip that you can keep the station together it opens up to reveal the station and on the side we have a bell and there's a fireman's pole and there's little sections that we can put different things in as we go. And here the set comes with a bag of goodies. Let's take a look at what we've got. Here we have our three figures, Station Officer Steel, Tom Thomas and Fireman Sam. And there's a station control set, table, two chairs, there's a fire bucket, fire extinguisher, a handle, two pieces that I'm not sure, that might go on the uh, Wallaby one, I'm not sure what this piece is for yet, but we've got some um, metal cutters and um, a, a strap for something, that might be for Wallaby one as well, that might be a safety harness. And there's also a cupboard to keep all of the firefighters uniforms and also we have a ladder. Let's fill up our fire station of Ponty Pandy full of fireman Sam things. And next in our set we have Wallaby One. So it's a lovely bright orange colour and here's the rotor blades and here's the winch on the side so I think that this hooks onto here and also we have Tom Thomas that we can put in the front. Here's our pilot Tom Thomas all ready for takeoff. Just take a close look at this fantastic Wallaby One. And Wallaby One even has a rescue belt. And Fireman Sam is demonstrating how it works. That's amazing, says Fireman Sam. And next we have Venus and Venus is the water carrier and this is what our Venus looks like so it's bright red and yellow all over there's um, a tow bar at the back this is the water tank with the hose on the top and we've got the wing mirrors on either side we've got the lights and the horns at the front and there's a little steering wheel. The doors open so we can put some figures inside. And there we are, we can fit Fireman Sam in the driver's position and Station Officer Steel inside. Let's take another close look inside. And here we have Tom Thomas in the kitchen area. And it includes a cooker, a toaster and a kettle and a nice table and chairs. And on the ground floor, we have the station doors where all the vehicles come in and out and a safety poster. And upstairs on the other side is where station officer still receives all of the information about the emergencies. And the firefighters can come down the fireman's pole instead of using the ladder. That 
that's cool. And we have the bell. There's a station picture of all of the crew. There's a station bell on the inside that can ring. And also there's first aid cupboard on the wall. And of course we have the fireman's helmets, the oxygen cylinders and all of the equipment that they can store inside their cabinets. And lastly we have the rotating turntable that can turn the vehicles around as they come into the station. So first up here comes Venus. Let's turn her around shall we? That's awesome, Fireman Sam. How about Tom Thomas in Wallaby One? And here we go. So this is an absolutely amazing play set and it's the Ponty Pandy Rescue Set and it included Fireman Sam, Station Officer Steel, Wallaby One and Venus. And of course we've got the Carry Along Fire Station with all the accessories. So if you like Fireman Sam and if you like toys, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and come back for a whole lot more. This is Tracy here and welcome back to the MG Tracy Club and today I've just had a delivery. I wonder what could be inside. Let's open up and take a look inside. Oh wow! It's a Fireman Sam mini rescue playset and it's the Ocean Rescue Centre. This looks very cool. There's even a little mini hydras inside. So watch me unbox this toy and put it together. Let's get started.
So then guys, be sure to like this video and also be sure to subscribe to the MG Tracy channel. Shortly, four boxes will appear. Tap on any of those boxes to continue the toy fun. Welcome to MG Tracy. Well, today you join us, Fireman Sam, with his dog radar and Peppa Pig are getting some sodas in the shop. It's a hot day and they're thirsty. When all of a sudden, the master alarm was sounded. Great fires of London, said Fireman Sam. That's the main alarm. It's an emergency. Back to Jupiter, quick. Fireman and Sam and Peppa Pig ran outside and they just could not believe what they saw. Almost every building was on fire in Ponty Pandy. Quick, I've got to get to Jupiter. Peppa Pig ran off to get her fire engine to help. Every building in Ponty Pandy was alight. This is what became known as the Great Fire of Ponty Pandy. A fire that everybody talks about. But while Fireman Sam and Peppa Pig went to get their fire engines, the fire continued to burn and poor Rubble was so scared. Oh, this is so bad, said Rubble. Every building is alight. I just can't believe it. All of this was started by just one firework. But in the distance, we could hear the fire engines. They're coming to the rescue of the folk of Ponty Pandy. Thank goodness. Come on, then. Let's go. Here comes Fireman Sam Fire now. Peppa Pig wasn't far behind with her special fire engine. Here comes Nurse Flood, followed by Station Officer Steel on Bessie. We need every emergency vehicle for a fire of this size. Here's Elvis and Tom Thomas now with Venus. All the vehicles are being positioned, ready to put out all of the fires. My goodness, no one has ever seen anything like this great fire of Ponty Pandy. Sam gets the hose out of Jupiter and makes a start on the first building. First Sam checks if anyone's in the building, but luckily everyone's got out safely. It's just a question of getting those fires out. Good, that's the first flames dealt with. That's the second window with the fire put out. Now just for the last one. Excellent, says Sam. That first building's dealt with. Let's see how Pepper's getting on with Mike's garage. Pepper and Rubble get out the fire extinguisher so they can work on the next fire. 
and as quick as a flash, the first fire is out in the tower. And then Mike's garage is saved, and that fire is also out. Now on to the next fire. Here, with the help of Bessie, Station Officer Steele is dealing with the next fire. Thank goodness, he says, as that fire is extinguished as well. Bessie may be old, but she's still brilliant. With no men injured and no casualties, moves the ambulance out of the way, so Fireman Sam can deal with the shot fire. Sam jumps out, ready to deal with this next emergency. And soon he has the first of the fires out in the shop. Now it's just the next fire to deal with. This fire is a bit more stubborn, it just doesn't seem to want to go out. But Fireman Sam battles on. Finally, that fire's out as well. Well done, Fireman Sam! Fireman Sam runs over to help Elvis and Tom Thomas, who are still trying to put out the final fire, actually in the fire station. Leave this to me, said Fireman Sam. And very soon he's in the thick of it, trying to put out the last fire. <gasps> and he does. Well done Fireman Sam, well done Elvis, and well done Tom Thomas. Everyone's helped out here from Rubble, Pepper Pig, Nurse Flood, and Station Officer Steel. This has been a true team effort, and it just shows what you can do when everybody pulls together and works together in such an emergency. The Great Fire of Pontypandy has been extinguished, and no one's been hurt. That's great news. So please like, share and subscribe and come back for a whole lot more here on the MG Tracy Club. Bye bye for now. Goodbye. Residents of Ponty Pandy said Station Officer Steele, welcome to the annual show around. This is the time when we get to show you around all the important work that we do here. So if you've got any questions, just ask me. And be careful and remember to wear your safety hats. Well done folks, make sure you keep those hats on throughout this tour. First, let's have a look at the safety equipment that we store up these stairs. Follow me. Now, if you follow where my hand is pointing, said Station Officer Steele, you will see that there is fire extinguishers, a bucket, a tool, some other hammers and some cones, all very important parts of fire rescue missions, as you can understand. During the speech, Naughty Norman looked curious and very, very, very naughty. Dillis leaned over and said, Now remember, Norman, there's no touching today. I don't want any of your funny business, OK? Now, commencing the next part of the tour, behind you to your left, you'll see this is where the firefighters store their very important uniforms and their hats. We've also got a picture of our lovely staff there, featuring myself, a fireman Sam, and Elvis, of course. And then to my right, we've got a map here. This shows all the important locations. Let me just show you how Juno launches off and how we signal the master alarm. Follow me. Now, signalling the master arm is very important because this tells all the firefighters that they have to come at once because there's an actual fire to respond to. Let me show you how it works. And this lovely looking jet ski here is called Juno. 
Juno's used when we need to rescue someone quickly out at sea. And it's operated by one single firefighter. You'll see there's one seat there and a steering wheel. Now to release Juno, all we have to do is this. We loosen her up here, like this. And then Juno is actually able just to launch off like this. Now if you'd all like to follow me, I'll show you where the helipad is. Come on folks! Once all of the other people had followed Station Officer Steele to the helipad, Naughty Norman felt very naughty. <laughs> now I know how to work Juno, maybe I can use Juno. And he hopped straight on. That's the master alarm. It looks like Naughty Norman's been very naughty. You can slow down. Just try and press the brake. Come on, you can do it. Press the brake. Brake! Fireman Sam launched a rubber ring round his neck for his safety. Come on, Norman, jump on board. Now, Norman, I think we're going to have to have another little chat about your safety at sea, aren't we? Yes, yeah, sorry, Fireman Sam. Hmm. They pulled back into the fire station. Now click on one of these four boxes to continue the fun. Nick was taking his whole family for a ride in the country. They were in Ponty Pandy and Daddy Pig was taking Pepper to see Fireman Sam. He also had Mummy Pig and Little George in the car. Here they come now, they're nearly at the fire station. met outside the fire station by Station Officer Steele, Elvis Cridlington and Fireman Sam. OK Pepper, I've got a fun day planned for you, said Fireman Sam, but firstly, you need to look the part. You need to dress like a firefighter. Pepper Pig just couldn't wait and as if by magic, she transformed into a firefighter. Peppa Pig reporting for duty, said Peppa Pig to Fireman Sam. Good show, said Fireman Sam. Let's get you into the station and let's see what we have for you to do. OK, Fireman Sam. And with that, they all waved the Peppa Pig family off on their travels. Station, Station Officer Steel wanted Peppa Pig to hear the master alarm. So Peppa, brace yourself, this is going to be loud. Oh, I don't know about this, said Peppa. It'll be okay. It was very loud and it was very scary. <laughs> I don't know if I like that station officer still. Now there, there, Pepper. Why don't you go upstairs and see Fireman Sam and he'll show you our fireman's pole. <gasps> okay, that sounds exciting. And off she went. Now then, Pepper, this is our firefighter's pole. Let's have a go. First up was Fireman Sam. Whee! I never get tired of that, says Fireman Sam. Come on, Peppa, it's your turn. I feel a bit nervous, says Peppa Pig. Oh, Peppa, you'll be fine. You'll enjoy it. OK, Fireman Sam. Here I come, she says. Ouch. Oh, Fireman Sam, that 
was so much fun. Can I have another go? Please, please, can I have another go? Please. Well, Pepper, another day we've got something else to look forward to. We've got a visitor, a very special visitor with a very special vehicle. <gasps> Fireman Sam, what can that be? Well, come on, we need to go outside and have a look. <gasps> oh, Fireman Sam, I can't wait, I can't wait. Oh, let's go outside. Oh, this is so much fun. Outside the fire station, Peppa Pig got such a lovely surprise. This beats jumping in muddy puddles any day, Fireman Sam. Oh, I'm pleased to hear that, says Fireman Sam. And then she couldn't believe her eyes. First of all, she could see Elvis Gridlington with Venus. Then she could see Station Officer Steel with Venus number two, which was bigger than the previous Venus. And lastly, she could see Tom Thomas with an even bigger Venus. So then Peppa, we have three different size Venuses, so we will always be ready for any emergency. Oh Fireman Sam, that's amazing, says Peppa Pig. Please subscribe. This is Tracy here and welcome back to the MG Tracy Club. So today we've got this amazing Playmobil City action to share with you. And it's for ages 5 to 10 and if you'd like to know the number is 5361. Well it looks enormous, it looks fantastic, so let's open it up and take a good look. It's a very large box so I just need to turn it on its side to open it up. So let's take a look inside. <gasps> Oh wow, look at all of these pieces. Wow we look at all of these. We've got chairs, we've got shovels, we've got the bottom of chairs, we've got all sorts of things. We've got computers, it looks like looks like little fixes. Oh, there's a little um, walkie-talkie in there. Oh, we've got uh, the people inside, the firefighters. They look very cool. Lots of windows and different things. And this is the structure of the fire station. Okay, looking pretty cool. And this looks like an interesting package. So we've got stickers, we've got the instructions, we've got these tiny pieces here. And gives us a picture on the back to show us what it could look like. So let's get started then guys. Okay so we have the instructions and it's a step-by-step -step guide of how to put this fire station together. That's pretty cool. We've got a Playmobil little leaflet that shows us all the other Playmobil exciting toys that, uh, that can be bought. Oh there's history, pirates, wildlife, uh, City action spacecraft. Uh, let's see if we can find. Ah, here we are. Here's the fire station, fire engines, firefighter. Looks amazing. Okay, so oh, also inside, I think this is probably uh, the fireman's house. We've got stickers as well. We've even got axes and choppers, and we've got all sorts of things. Ooh, what's in here? Hmm, not sure what they are got all these pieces to fit together so we're gonna be busy let's get started
So then guys, if you like toys and if you like fire engines, be sure to like this video and be sure to subscribe to the MG Tracy channel. Also, four boxes will appear at the end of this video. Touch on one of the boxes to continue the toy fun.